Hey guys, this is Pokemaniac101, and welcome back to my playthrough of Minecraft Story Mode. In the last episode, we broke into the Founder's Palace in order to try to rescue Ivor and Lucas, which, well, they, they broke out themselves and somehow found us also in the throne room. And now we're trying to find the Eversource to take back for the people. So we need to do... So we're still look at... The, the Eversource is supposed to be behind some hidden door. But, um, not sure how hidden it would be. Maybe in the bookcase. There's a lot of movies about, um, like, you know, pulling a book away and it's actually the lever or something. So let's look at this. By Soren? Well, how'd that get here? Soren? Huh. But, so Soren lives in our world, but, you know, that they, they live in the Sky Island here. Like, what's this view? Yeah, let, let's look at this. See, they live in the sky, and nothing below them. Nothingness, I mean. I wonder how, like... I wonder how they got a book from the Order of the Stone, from our world. Unless they came through the portal, but... Um, the portal we came... It, well, when we got here, there wasn't an exit portal that I saw. It was just... They just dropped us. So maybe, I wonder how that was, was that's possible. I've always wanted time behind bars to work on my poetry. That was sarcasm. In case you were curious. Especially since like the founder and all the people here, like, they live their entire lives not thinking there's anything beneath them, so how they would get something from Soren, who lived really recently. It still lives. That's huh, that's just I a mystery. A this is a special tree. Yes, the ground you're standing on is actually the original island that all of Sky City started from. That tree dropped the saplings that grew into every tree on the island. I may not agree with the founder's methods, but even I must admit, that's an impressive feat. <laughs> yeah. Well, that is pretty special. Cause like okay, so the founder would have had to live in our world, or someone before the founder. Hmm, I'm not sure. Wait, <laughs> I can look out. I'm gonna stay on the throne. Let's just why not? <laughs> yeah, Jesse, get comfortable, Jesse. What are you doing? Ah, sorry. <laughs> okay, so the bookshelf didn't have the secret door, and. Maybe, might be over, nah, I don't think the secret door would be, like, right over here by, um, where Petra's guarding, because that's, like, the main entrance, that's where everyone goes in and out. Um, well, there's some redstone right here, blocked, <laughs> oops, sorry, I meant, <laughs> okay, that's not much of a hidden doorway. <laughs> I'm getting a very door vibe from this. Yeah. What happened to it? Just need to make something to activate that redstone circuit again. There's got to be something in here we can use. Like a lever. If you can find one of those bad boys, we'll have that secret door open in a snap. Because that's not a very... Th this is a very sus suspicious trail of redstone. And now that I think of it, I didn't notice it before, but the rails also move right into there, so... <laughs> okay. Well, I'll... It it's not very hidden, but... If you think about it, it doesn't really have to because all these people here don't really, they wouldn't really know what redstone was, would they? Um, because, you know, since, you know, they have to get, like, special permission and, like, get on a wait list or something to cook a pork chop. So, doing redstone circuitry, I highly doubt the founder would allow them to do. But anyway, uh, we need a lever and there's some cobblestone right here. Lava and water, placed exactly far enough that when they collide, it creates cobblestone. Genius! <laughs> I was that excited about cobblestone generator. Okay, I just see this over here when we were talking about the tree or whatever. But I don't think they need. <laughs> it's infinite cobblestone. I don't think they'll miss one. Genius. Okay, so now we need to get some wood. Um. 
Except the only wood around here is that tree right there, which it didn't really let me get near to, and this tree right here. But <laughs> it's a special tree. It's the it's some sort of special like thing. So I doubt they would want me to get wood. I think they would notice if I had gotten a big chunk of wood was missing out of that. Um. Oh, wait. There's a dead bush right here. They give sticks, Poor don't they? Bush. Barely more than a bundle of sticks. Yeah. <laughs> It literally says sticks. Okay, let's Hopefully get. Hopefully, no one will miss one dead bush. Let's get some sticks. Perfect. And now there's a craft. Should be everything I need to make a lever now. All right. Now there's a crafting table right here that we can use to make a lever. Okay, let's do this. One of the simplest recipes out there. <clears throat> that unfortunately uh, most people the in this town won't know. <laughs> Didn't know you were oh. watching. My apologies. It is still just such a thrill to see someone so confident and sure in their building abilities. <laughs> hey, my Milo's lived with these uh, people just as long as they have, so it, Milo's lived here just as long as they have. So he, I bet he was he's excited about building. I don't blame him for trying to watch over my shoulder. <laughs> okay, now we open the secret door, and there's minecarts. Makes sense because there's a track. This is it. Oh, did you hear? Source, here we come. Did you hear those like banging sounds? Yeah. Listen, to those like creaking and banging sounds. Those aren't in actual Minecraft, but I wouldn't mind if they added them. Listen, listen to the Minecraft sounds. Those metallic screeches and crunches, and I actually like those. That it fits. I think it would fit Minecraft really well if they actually put those in the game. Mojang, if you're watching this, which you probably aren't, but still, please. <laughs> There's a bunch of chests here with a bunch of with signs. With animals. Maybe... Spawn eggs. Okay. The sign says sheep, not eggs. Might as well throw it and Oh, it's a sheep spawn egg. Have you ever played Minecraft? You are Minecraft. Never mind. <laughs> a sheep? Is is that a monster? Uh, no. It's not so bad. It is fluffy. <laughs> the eggs all have creatures inside them, and they're all different colors. They must be, you know, color coded. What's Pretty sure that's a blazing so ocelot egg. She can just spawn things whenever she wants to. Well, these eggs provide materials. So this must be I mean, like, the resources come zombies pr different monsters and produce creatures? iron, Drops. pigmen produce gold. We're close. So yeah, that makes sense. Can't wait. A cobblestone generator. Let's take a look around. I right, create all this cobblestone. All the coal. What is, what is. Wither skeletons. Wither skeletons drop coal. But I'm trying to think of, like, other stuff in this world that couldn't be created from cobblestone wood or mob drops. Hmm. Maybe redstone. No, witches drop redstone. Okay. So yeah, like everything in here. No, dirt. Dirt isn't created by it. And so unless they had a crap ton of dirt at the beginning when they started this world. And there's a chicken. <laughs> Incredible. Um well, this is weird. Wow, well, this is pretty weird. Is this some what? sort of royal chicken? It has like a it's crown on. A chicken. Crown and a medallion. So the chicken lays the eggs, and the eggs make monsters, and the loot from the monsters made this place. Well, throw it in the minecart and <laughs> get out of here. Don't scare the chicken. Right? The chicken that the entire city depends on? Are you sure that's a good idea? What are you talking about? We need to bring it to the people. With it, we'll finally be free of the founder. But that clucking thing is um, for. Leave where it is. We're taking the chicken of the people. We came here so we could get it for the people. Milo's right. The ever source belongs to the Besides, people. it. I Lucas is right. It's whole the whole thing. It's the thing that the entire city depends on. But we're not bringing it out of the city. Wait. Oh, what's going on? Oh, it's the ocelots. Not ocelots. Blaze rods. <laughs> and the founder. Who knows martial arts, apparently. <laughs> That's a random sheep. Um, let's just talk about this. I know this looks suspicious. 
a second. Let's talk about this, okay? I'm not sure there's anything to talk about. It's just like I told you, Founder. They're here to steal the Eversource. Classic. We're not stealing it. We're moving it. It's still going to stay in your you city. Say. What? No. Um. Don't believe them. You have the wrong idea. Uh, you're the bad guy. No, 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 no. You don't get to spin it like this, Aiden. You're the bad guy. You just expect me to believe a bunch of criminals? Aiden warned me. Uh, Aiden's doing something. Thieves. And here you are. Hold on. Hey, Prepare turn around. Off with the one thing our city depends on to survive. Boy. When you put it like no. that, I almost feel bad. What's he doing? Creepers, yep. no. Afraid I'm going to be taking the chicken. It's mine now. What? This is outrageous. Aiden, don't do this. Somebody Watch out. Eggs. No. Duck. Oh, I barely dodged it. Reaper, look out. Destroy it. Oh no, the founder. And the sheep's just hanging off for dear life. No! Aww. For a sheep lover, that really sucks. Okay. Um. Save the founder, back up Lucas. Um. Founder, she's in more danger than Lucas is. He's not in any mortal danger at all. He's just, you know, in a fist fight with Aiden. Okay, there we go. What? No! And just when I said he wasn't in any mortal danger. Oh, man, now we're falling as well. <laughs> the face is just like, you. <laughs> okay, well, there has to be something down here. Whether there's another island or just a large ocean or something, but I doubt they would just kill us off like that. Um, it doesn't matter whose fault it is right now. Oh wait, no. It's more than an ocean. There's desert and forests and <laughs> and the lava that I from Ivor's school um, tribute impossible. thing. Jesse, there. Can we get to it in time? It's gonna be close. Okay. So it's we need to try to avoid the lava, but there also is ground like directly beneath us. So let's let's move up. Okay, let's just try to center ourselves on the water. I'm not sure if that's good enough. It is kind of like an angle, so I'm not sure where the water is. Okay, hold on. Right here, maybe? Yes! Okay. There we go. And the sheep's alive! That makes me happy. <laughs> Jesse? Holy and crap. Lucas. You're down here too? Lucas, you made it! Oh, yeah, only slightly worse for wear. Ah, gotta say, Aiden's tougher than I remember. Um uh, pretty good. I'm glad you're okay. I'm just so glad you're okay. When Aiden pitched you over the side, that was awful. Yeah, I wasn't a huge fan either. <laughs> it was good of you to try and save the founder. Uh speaking of whom, is she okay? Oh yeah, she must be like mesmerized by this place. Uh let me ask. Founder? Miss Founder? I uh hope she's not in shock. Um are you doing okay? You uh, doing okay over there? I just I I can't believe it. <sighs> mm. This has been down here the whole time. I forbade anyone to look for land. Um, it was too dangerous. Let's will change everything. Well, your, peop is gonna your people can live down here now. You guys. I mean, it's going to change everything. Yes. No more anti-build laws. Totally untouched biomes all around us. Yes, it's all a little overwhelming. What what do I do now? Well, how about you start with a few Um well first we kick Aiden's butt. <laughs> first things first, we're gonna go back up there and kick Aiden's butt. Sounds like the start of a winning plan to me. Getting back up. My word, you're right. We need to do that. 
I hadn't even thought that far ahead yet. Oh, that's a zombie. Oh no, Aiden's probably doing something up there. He's out. Oh. <laughs> Aiden's probably spawning monsters just all over the place up there. It must be chaos. We need to get back up there and stop him. Um, your city's in trouble. Definitely a bad sign. Your city's probably in big trouble right now. in whatever trouble they're in. Jesse, will you please help me get back to Sky City? Stop Aiden. Help me protect my people. Um, of course I'll help you. We did kind of start this mess. Of course I'll help you. You're the founder. Thank you, Jesse. And please, call me Issa. Okay, Issa? getting back up. I'll probably just still call her the founder. <laughs> Let's see what we've got to work with. There's uh, dirt. That'll work. See where you're getting at. Um, it's time no, for someone cares. <laughs> it's time for one big build. Get ready to build something huge, maybe the biggest thing of your life. What do you mean? We're gonna build a tower of dirt all the way back up to Sky City. Grab as much dirt as you can carry. Okay, let's do. Oh, that, I was hitting E. Oh, okay. I know Minecraft story mode is normally fast with these types of things, but this is just like really really speedy uh, okay. I guess that makes up for the um, what is that? that makes up for the really slow ladder build oh it's the exit portal um that's the other half what? of my portal what is it? it's the other half of the portal that brought me I was about to say that <laughs> that build that digging really makes up for the really slow ladder um, ladder building in the last episode Yes, I I think so. I uh I think I actually gotta sit this one out, Jesse. Aiden got me pretty good. I'm just not sure I'm up for towering all the way back up there. So I'm really sorry. Um we wouldn't be able to keep up anyway. <laughs> it's dangerous to what stay alone. Dangerous alone. Monsters, nightfall. I'll get some food, put together a shelter if it gets dark. It's not my first rodeo. Reminds me of Zelda. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Gets a sword. A wooden sword, granted, but there still a sword. Go, buddy. <laughs> Thank you for trying to help. It was very noble. At least I hey, think it was a wooden sword. Last goodbye tone. I'll see you guys when you get back. Oh, give Aiden another punch for me. <laughs> do. Come on, we've got an epic climb ahead of us. We've got a city to save. You ready? I believe so. And when I get up there, I'm going to tear those blaze rods limb from limb. Um, okay. <laughs> oh, and Jesse, I appreciate what you did up there. Trying to save me, I mean. Okay, so let's do this. Oh. It must be really awkward to place like that. Okay, so let's go up. It's starting to rain as well. <laughs> serious, there's some serious head banging going on right now. <laughs> okay, I don't want to spoil anything, or at least I, I, of course I'm gonna play through it, but I don't really wanna, um, I don't really wanna like start the fight, because I I can tell it's gonna be a big thing, so I don't want to start the fight and then have to fi like end the episode mid fight. Um, so I'm just gonna save, just gonna save it there. I don't, I just, I'm just gonna have the next episode be like my entire, the entire, um, you know, retake over of Sky City. But, um, anyway, uh, that's the end of this episode. I guys, I hope you guys enjoy it and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.